Well, just a few months after crews started tearing down the Brown County Veterans Memorial Arena and Shopko Hall, Brown County leaders held a groundbreaking ceremony today for the new Expo Center going up in its place. NBC 26's Jennifer Nazan was there. So one, two, three. Yes. Out with the old and in with the new. Brown County leaders say the new Expo Center was much needed. This was not an easy uh, thing to come by. Uh, it makes you proud, you know, essentially that we're not dying. You know, we're not falling apart where people are not willing to make an investment. And officials have high hopes for the $93 million facility. This building represents really an opportunity for us to be continue to be competitive. Uh, it allows us to draw in a lot more business. Last year, tourism brought in more than $1 billion to Brown County, according to the Visitors Bureau. It's huge. It's huge for the community. It's going to allow them to bring bigger and better shows. The 127,000 square foot Expo Center will also bring more job opportunities to the area. There'll be several hundred workers from the area involved in this project. Um, several local contractors supported and suppliers. So. It should be a great boost to the construction community. The rest center means a lot to me. It's like it was, you know, I walk into there, it, was, it brings me back 18 years, and it's really a good feeling to know that I was a part of that. So I'll feel the same with the Brown County Expo. In Ashwabanon, Jennifer Nazza, NBC 26. Myron Construction expects the new Expo Center to be open by January of 2021.